Hello class! Welcome back to our channel. So for today's video, ituturo ko sa inyo guys yung difference between the exponential functions, equations, and inequalities. So first, define mo natin ano bang ibig sabihin ng isang exponential function. It is a function involving exponential expression. Pag sinabi natin exponential expression guys, ito yung expression na merong um, variable as exponent. Okay? So, usually, ang ginagamit natin dito, guys, is yung x. Okay? So, showing a relationship between the independent variable x and the dependent variable y or f of x. For example, meron tayong f of x equals uh, 2 raised to 2x plus a. Uh, 2 raised to x plus 3. So, as you can see, guys, meron tayong f of x indicating na meron tayong function, then meron din tayong exponential expression since yung variable natin is nasa exponent. Tama? Another example is yung y equals 10 raised to 2x. So, dito yung variable natin nasa, ex nasa exponent, ibig sabihin, yan ay exponential expression. Naintindihan? So, on the other hand, an, an exponential equation is an equation, ito yung gumagamit ng equals, involving exponential expression that can be solved for all x values satisfying the equation. So, for example, meron tayong 121 equals 11 raised to x. Since yung 11 raised to x is an exponential expression, ibig sabihin, uh, this equation, guys, is an example of exponential equation. Nakuha? Another example, meron tayong 3 raised to x equals 9 raised to x minus 2. So, yung both sides natin ay parehas exponential expression. Okay, so therefore, uh, this example is an exponential equation. Okay? So, last is yung ating exponential inequality. It is an inequality. Pag sinabing inequality, ito yung gumagamit ng greater than, greater than or equal, less than and less than or equal. Okay? Involving exponential expression that can be solved for all x values. So, for example, meron tayong 64 raised to 1 third, then greater than, indicating na meron tayong inequality, then, yung 2 raised to x natin is an example of exponential expression. So, that means na yung inequality natin ay exponential inequality. Naintindihan? Then, last, meron tayong 0 0.9 raised to x greater than 0 0.81. So, dito, yung 0 0.9 raised to x, yan yung ating exponential expression. Then, meron tayong inequality. So, ibig sabihin, ito ay example of exponential inequality. Nakuha? So, let's have more examples. So, this time, classify natin, guys, uh, yung, yung examples natin as um, exponential function, equation, inequality, or does not belong to any of these three. Okay? So, this time, gamitin na lang natin uh, EF. Kung siya ay exponential function. Then, lagay natin um, EE kung exponential equation naman. Then, EI kung siya naman ay um, exponential inequality. Okay? Then, um, DNB na lang kung does not belong. Okay, so try natin. So first example natin, we have 32 raised to x minus 4 less than or equal 16 raised to x plus 2. So dito guys, meron tayong inequality. Then meron tayong exponential expression. So ibig sabihin, ito ay exponential inequality. Okay? Pangalawa, meron tayong um, equation. Then, meron din tayong exponential expression. So, ito ay exponential equation or EE. Nakuha? 
Pangatlo, meron naman tayong 6 greater than 1 over 36 raised to x. So, ito ay exponential inequality. Okay? Next, we have x raised to 7 plus 1 less than 10 times x raised to, e to 8. Okay? So, dito guys, as you can see, wala tayong nakikitang exponential expression. By the way, again, ang exponential expression, siya yung expression na merong variable sa kanyang exponent. Okay? So, dito, wala tayong variable sa mga exponent. So, ito yung does not belong to any of the three. Tama? Okay, another example, we have y equals x raised to 5. So, again, uh, wala tayong exponential expression dito. So, does not belong ang ating sagot. Next, we have 64 equals 2 raised to x plus 2. So, meron tayong exponential expression. So, ito ay exponential equation. Okay? Next, we have 100 greater than 10 raised to 2x. So, exponential inequality since meron tayong exponential expression. f of x equals x cubed. Okay, so x cubed is hindi siya example ng exponential expression. So, ito ay does not belong. Tama? Next, we have uh, g of x, which is a function, equals 4 raised to 5x. Okay, so meron tayong exponential expression. So, ito ay exponential function. Okay? Next, we have y equals 5 raised to x minus 1. So, dito guys, meron tayong y. So, it means meron tayong function. Then, at the same time, meron tayong exponential expression. So, this is exponential function. Okay? So, next, we have 1 half raised to x plus 2 equals 1 over 8 raised to x. So, dito, uh, naka-equation tayo. Then, we have 2 exponential expression so this this is an example of exponential equation okay next we have f of x so which means na yan ay exponential um uh, yan ay function then meron tayong exponential so this is exponential function next we have 7 equals 49 raised to x so, this is an example of exponential equation. Tama? Next, we have 27 less than, tapos 3 raised to x. So, this is exponential inequality. Okay? Then, for our last example, meron tayong f of x indicating na function yan. Then, meron tayong exponential. So, this is exponential function. Okay? So, this is the end of our video. I hope naiintindihan nyo guys kung ano ba yung exponential function, equation, and inequality. So, if you have questions or clarifications, kindly put them in the comment section below. So, thank you guys for watching. This is Prof. D. I'll catch you on the flip side. Bye! Mm -hmm.